Okay, so here we are at Tea in the Park at Balado. The sun is shining. Another miracle. We had a heat wave last year. Yeah. <laughs> Nathan and Troy from Little Matador. Absolutely fantastic band. Uh, get a hold of their uh, debut album, also called Little Matador. It's an absolute cracker. And guys, how's your? How did you get on getting here? Everything goes smoothly. Yeah, everything's great. I'm, you know, as always, Tea in the Park. You know, we, I said every time I'm here, but it's genuinely one of my favourite festivals. And uh, yeah, I've been excited about it. And it's great to be here with this band and, you know, getting to bring Little Mallard to the Tiena Park. So. Of course, I mean, you, you just kind of brought up the fact that you've played here before. For, for people who don't know you, you and another little band that have kind of Scottish roots, haven't you? Yes, I am. Uh, Scotland's a kind of adopted home for, for me and the other lads at uh, Snow Patrol. So, um, yeah, I'm the guitar player in that band for people who don't know. Um, yeah, so, and, you know, again, it's, it's again, great as like, for me to come back with a new band and new music and, and not to miss out in another year to in the park. And uh, what does it feel like for, for people, just for the pub, general public, what does it feel like to take the stage at a festival like this? Well, to in the park specifically, I mean, there, you know, there's, there's a lot of festivals in the UK, obviously, everyone knows what they are, uh, are, are great, but I mean, certainly for me, you know, it's kind of because they're home crowds, you know, uh, for me, the Scottish and Irish crowds are always a little, a little wilder. Um, they, they, they go with it. They have fun, and you know, Tina Park being kind of the, the, the kind of pinnacle of that. Really, you know, we've had a lot of fun here over the years, and uh, yeah, it's just. And, and I mean, plus, you know, there's so many people I, I, I know here and that work here and are part of this festival and, and bands that we meet every year, and um, you know, it's just, it's great. It's the last day in the park at Balado. Yes, that's right. Do you think that'll make it a, a special kind of weekend? Well, special? I mean, it's a huge, certainly tonight even in, in itself, you know, Biffy Claro, which is their 10th year of playing. I think they beat us to the, well, so to, to the to the pip on that one, but uh, technically I think so. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it's a bit 20, 21 years gone. It's just, you know, and, and to see it going as strong as it's ever been going, you know, and the lineup is always flawless as far as I'm concerned so yeah I mean it'll be sad to, to kind of to kind of move on from here you know but but you know, almost an upwards to see where the end of work goes you know. uh, Troy tell us uh, a little bit story. tell us where and when people can see you today we're going to be at the uh, BBC introducing 10 on the transmission stage at 4 o'clock uh, turned up loud ready to go so make your definitely make your way over I definitely wouldn't miss that and uh, where do you go from here have you got other festivals is this part of like a a circuit of festivals that you do at this time of year? Yeah, we've been we've been uh, going about the last two and a half, three weeks. Uh, we head down, we'll be up 2,000 trees tomorrow. Um, then uh, we'll be at Wakestock the day after. And then we'll kind of wrap it up, but then we'll be back for Bell Sonic with Biffy Claro on the 17th of August. Yeah. And uh, then Red in Leeds after that. And lastly, if you guys get the chance, is there any, any of the acts that are playing today that you'd like to try and catch at Team Park? Uh, yeah, loads of bands. Um, the, the, the really frustrating thing for me is this year, and I'm genuinely quite gutted about it, we have to leave uh, this evening, so uh, I'm going to miss Biffy's show, which is uh, very annoying, but you know, there's plenty of bands I want to catch. Obviously, I'm not going to see the Pixies, um, but there's great bands like Lager, who we've toured with recently as well. Um, I can't remember what stage they're on, but they're a great band, um, so we'll definitely be catching them. Royal Blood, um, so they're probably the only two things we're going to get to catch in between everything we've got going on. So. But as I say, though, you know, it's just Tiana Park every year and the lineup's always brilliant. So. Great. But well, Troy and Nathan from you. Little Matador, thanks so much. No, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks, man. Nice one.